This is a video to demonstrate the various uses of the Dash DAC OBD2 scanner gauge tool on an XR6 Turbo. Okay, the Dash DAC just uses a suction mount on the back, attaches to the windscreen, the cord then runs into the OBD2 port. Just plugs in, I run the cord through cover and just go straight in. Turn it on, you got a button on the front. Then goes through its startup. And there's my gauge screen that I run. It won't show anything at the moment because the cars are off. The car needs to be on ignition and running to show the gauges. I can exit and go into the menus. I've got gauges where I just was. I can do data logging, diagnostics, where you can read error codes. You got performance where you can do zero to a hundred or quarter mile times, and you got your setup. Go to diagnostics. I can read codes. You switch in the car. Ignition. There's no error codes. Go into data logging, I can set up a certain input I want to data log, like air intake temperature or speed. Okay, now I've got the car on ignition, you can see the intake temperature in the middle there, coolant temperature and system volts. If I don't like the readings on there, like this one here is for transmission temperature. I can change to a different signal. There's a massive list. I can change where it reads from. So at the moment it only reads from 50 to 110. I can set that to read up to 200 degrees if I want to or as low as I want. Or I can set a warning. I can set the warning so it changes colour or that a sound comes up over a certain temperature. I also have other screens as well, so I've got this screen set up, which is what I usually use. It's just like scrolling across on a smartphone screen. Needles move around. I'm also going to set up if I don't like the way that gauge looks, I can change to a different one by going into themes. Currently use that one there, I reckon it looks the best overall, but there's heaps of other ones. As you can see I've got the X6 Turbo splash screen when the dash deck starts up. How bright it is, I've one of the brightest. P 
powers off after five minutes when the car's turned off. You can't run it without unless it's plugged into the car. Performance. Go to a quarter mile test. What you do is you set up the speed reading from the car in the setup. You just pull up somewhere, press start, Christmas tree lights go down, and as soon as you go, it'll start logging. Once you finish at 400 meters, it'll bring up a time. You can also do 0 to 100, with the same idea. I've also got a shift light set up. And there, once I get to 5200, the whole screen goes orange with shift on there. And that's the dash deck.